Hi, I'm Kaki King, and this is my guitar. This is um, this is a guitar called a Griffin. Um, it's made by a, a luthier named Joe Vayette in Woodstock, New York, and um, it's a very strange little guitar. It's well, it's little first of all, and it's a twelve string. Um, it's a piece I think of like engineering genius because when you make a guitar, there's a lot of pressure right here on the bridge, um, and to have a guitar top that is both thin enough to sound good and strong enough to hold that pressure is really, it's, it, you have to be very crafty. Um, and this one, especially because it's a 12 string, it has, there's something like 200 pounds of pressure on this bridge. And all it's supported by is a thin piece of wood and bracing. Um, so Joe Vayette's a very creative builder. And um, I first heard this guitar, I was working, um, I was working on a little project and a um, old producer of mine named David Torn. Uh, he was at the studio and he had one. Um, David lives up in Woodstock near Joe and um, he brought one down and I, he said, check this out. And I touched it and I played it and I went, the first thought was, I have to have one, you know. Um, and it wasn't until a few years later that that actually uh, happened. Joe's been incredibly kind to me, helping out with all kinds of guitars, um, and, and he makes a lot of weird things. So let me explain a little bit more about this guitar. It's, um, it's set up not, not like a normal 12 string, but it, it's all unison um, strings. So, uh, and normally it would be strung like D to D, but an octave above what a normal guitar register is. So what I've done, uh, because the strings are, um, they're all equal gauges, um, when, when two strings run together, it's called a course. Um, so it's, technically it has six courses and 12 strings. What I've done to the two of the courses is that I've, I've changed the note so they're no longer in unison. So, um, those are two different notes, those are a whole step apart, and then again. So actually I have eight notes while I play, um, and, it, and because this guitar has these magic, it has this magic resonance and overtone, you hear all these notes kind of floating, um, it's like a, you know, playing a piano with the pedal down, everything's kind of uh, re resonating together and interacting with each other as a harmonic. Um, this is one of the most special guitars I've ever played, honestly, and um, this guitar has a very, very bright um, trebly sound and normally that can be very biting or angry to the ear and you have to soften it um, but this one sounds it just sounds beautiful it sounds like angels and even if I play it really aggressively um, it just it never gets to the point where it's too sharp or too angry um, yet it retain it maintains this sound that's very very high and um, so the sound to me is it's really angelic like that's the word for it um, it's angelic and it's magical and um, it's a, it's just a very it's a pleasure to play. It feels incredible under the under the hand. It's it's almost you know an honor to be someone that Joe is willing to help out as a as a player, and um, I think that's about it. Would you like a song? <laughs>